Hi, my name is Kelvin, and today our video is about the Tropic of Cancer and the Sun. This is the Sun, and this is the Earth. As you can see, the it takes the shortest distance for the Sun's rays to travel to the Earth right here. At this point, when the ray is the shortest, the Earth is the hottest. And this imaginary line that goes through through the center of the Earth is called the equator. Actually, it doesn't go through the center of the Earth. It forms an imaginary band that goes from east to west. The equator forms a band of latitude at zero degrees. Actually, there are many of these bands going north and south of the equator. These are all imaginary lines. As I mentioned before, the equator starts at zero degrees. As we go north or south, the degrees increase. Next to that, we put our direction of travel. Let me show you an example. This is the equator. It's at zero degrees. This is the North Pole, and it's at 90 degrees north. And this is the South Pole, and it's at 90 degrees south latitude. The lines of latitude at 25 degrees north and 25 degrees south are special. Let me show you. At 25 degrees north and 25 degrees south, we have the Tropic of Cancer and Capricorn. This region of the Earth is called the tropics. They only experience two seasons, a wet season and a dry season. Now that we've discussed latitude, well, we can discuss longitude. Longitude is just like latitude. They are imaginary lines that run from north to south, and they gather from the North Pole to the South Pole. The point that starts at zero degrees at, on longitude is called the prime meridian, and that cuts off two hemispheres, the Eastern Hemisphere and the Western Hemisphere. The rest of this video is centered around the Tropic of Cancer. I get to show off my art skills. Don't laugh.